All right, so for the gastric bypass, we're gonna use five small incisions. You're gonna be completely out under general anesthesia for the whole thing. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna change the way food flows through from the stomach into the intestine. First, we're gonna make a little pouch. That's a small mini stomach, if you will. Then we're gonna go down and we're gonna separate the intestine and we're gonna bring one end up to the pouch and then the other end connects to itself, as you'll see in a second. So this is now the new connection between the pouch and the intestine, and that goes down. But the rest of the stomach actually stays in place. It's still there, it's still alive, it doesn't get removed or anything like that. But the significance of this operation is that the stomach itself in its entirety is a metabolic organ or a metabolic gland. And the problem or sort of the disease of obesity is that the metabolic gland is telling your body to be at a certain set point where you're stuck at. And so that's why people can't lose weight because the metabolic organ is telling the body the wrong weight. So in order to reset the thermostat settings, we're gonna make the stomach very small and that becomes the metabolically active part of the stomach and the rest of it just goes dormant. As we continue the operation, we're gonna connect the intestine to itself here. The food and fluid is gonna come in where the blue is and the green is collecting any bile or pancreatic secretions or anything draining out of the stomach, including acid, and it's gonna put it downstream. This is why this operation is very good for patients with heartburn and reflux, because this green bile and acid cannot go backwards up this road and back into the esophagus. So this is basically a curative treatment for reflux disease. Down here, we see the letter Y, and that's why it's called the RUNY gastric bypass where everything joins up that goes downstream and then goes into the intestine and then into the large intestine and then out to the outside world.